So now I'm going to do the tree part of it. Um, I started off with the, uh, the, uh, not the tree, the, the branches part of it. So I started off with the, um, the base of the tree and I'm just kind of letting that dry. I'll, I'll probably do last minute touch ups, but, um, with the green, it was kind of a brownish green. So I put, a, I put a squirt of brown and then, so what I'm going to do right now is just basically do the, the tree, right? And you want to make sure that you don't, this is just the base of the tree, right? So make it look a little bit, you know, squarish kind of thing, but ideally you don't want to make it too thick, right? You want it to look proportionate. You know, take a little bit of, you'll see I'll take a little bit of the paint off because what I'm going to do now is I'm going to do slight, like little branches in here. You'll see with the paintbrush, kind of mixing it together, right? And I'll go back again with the, the green. So it looks, you know, I'd say rudimentary kind of thing, but you know, that's just to start to get your base, right? Nice round tree, right? And then, like I said, do that on the other side over here. You basically want a, a branch like this. Kind of do, oops, my finger's in the way. Kind of do a little bit of a V shape to make a tree. You need a little bit more paintbrush, just kind of use the paintbrush kind of thing and mix the colors together. And don't worry about, see I made that one a little bit too thick, but you can always add to it when you're ready. So basically what I'm doing is I'm kind of mixing colors together. Like I said, a little bit thick, but that's okay. You know, we want trees that are decently spaced, you know, decently thick. So yeah, just kind of let that dry. You know, when you're ready, come with a little bit of thinner paintbrush. Right. And what you're going to do is basically put some branches in here. Oops. Okay. Put a little bit of branches in there and make it a little bit. You're kind of extending the branches. If you need more paint, make sure you grab more paint, but you can take it from the paintbrush too, right? So basically what you're doing is using a more fine paintbrush. And the hardest part is just walking away basically and letting it dry a little bit so it can come back. You can always add to it when it's not dry, but you don't want to, as you can see, that's kind of like the starting stages, right? I found this one's a little bit thicker, so I'm going to give it a little bit more, like kind of make it more, we'll see more, more detail, right? And then I'll go over again with the, with the, so yeah, kind of scary looking tree there. As you can see, a little bit scary, but that's okay. We can make it a little bit less scary by giving it a little bit of, I like to call it depth, but I mean, you can call it whatever you want. It's making it more real. Right. So like I said, it kind of, it's kind of step by step. So I'll come back and I'll kind of show you what I'm going to do next for the, to kind of go over it once it dries a little bit. Okay. See you soon.